My name is Tim Ria, host of Digital Health Live here in the actual conference studio. We're sponsored by WebMD this year. And if you hear any noise, it's because there's an actual conference going on. And space is so tight, there's like 800 people here. Uh, we have Melina Adamian. And you're one of the judges for the Everyday Health Awards. That is correct. Uh, I'm not only a judge uh, for Everyday Health Awards. This is my first CES, first Digital Health Summit. And I'm very excited to be a part of it. I'm honored and excited to be part of it. It was um, it was a great experience. Uh, by by you know I was my 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 background. I'm actually f I'm a venture capitalist. I'm early stage investor, uh, venture both venture and angel investor in healthcare technology companies and medical devices in anything virtually that improves access and delivery of healthcare and uh, outcomes. And so this this particular uh, category, this particular um, everyday health awards, were incredibly important in many for in, in, in many ways. Uh, first, I mean, it allowed us to look at the companies that are already either established and offered some spectacular solutions to uh, to consumers and uh, to consumers in healthcare. On the other hand, we also had looked at. Uh, uh, spectacular early stage companies and and there are several categories uh, let's say chronic diseases um, low aging uh, pet um, uh, uh, pet uh, I mean veterinary industry and stuff like that all of those are very promising markets very interesting markets and more importantly they are solving real problems so um, in general, Digital uh, Health Summit, which again, as I said, it was is is a first. Hopefully, my fir it's my first. Hopefully, not the last one. Has been spectacular because it covered so many uh, so many important topics, specifically in the very important times when uh, patients uh, and I would say industry and 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 physicians everyone now understood that there is a lot of consumerism going in healthcare so patient being a patient doesn't necessarily mean that he is or she is not a consumer exactly so um, you have an interesting background in the venture space funding company so you were picked because you know how to pick the jewels out of the rough and the everyday health awards was looking at what were the different categories this year well uh, I was uh, I was picked for I mean I have pretty much Probably an unusual background because uh, in my current reincarnation, I'm um, I'm an investor in early stage companies, uh, but uh, I'm c practicing cardiologist in the past. I was um, medical director at Boston Scientific and uh, used to be an anal uh, equity analyst on Wall Street. So that I mean, I would say all those kind of you know different pieces of and uh, of of experience allowed me to be you know allowed me to be um, um, chosen for this. For, for the Everyday Health Awards. Uh, we had people who had judges with different backgrounds. Some of them had investment background, some of them had operational background. Altogether, it brings a very well-rounded picture about what you're actually looking in a company. Not just, it's a great idea, or, oh, this is a, a terrific market, but altogether, is this a great idea? Will that actually work? Will that be, can you just commercialize it? Does it make sense? Cool, cool. So. Um can you name some of the companies who won? Uh, yeah, actually, the the uh, the interesting part of the whole uh, awards part was that uh, there were companies that judges chosen, and there were companies that were selected by audience. Yeah, people choice, and they actually pretty much coincided. I mean, yeah, at least one company there was a tie in a uh, people uh, people awards um, audience awards or something like that. Uh, there was. Um, learn something learn Sophie yeah. uh, it's a it's a basically think about it as a up-to-date or Hippocrates for veterinarians and this company actually got uh, became a winner in both categories in uh, both by judges and by the audience okay great so you can check out uh, the everyday health awards at digitalsummit.com we want to thank everyday health and the team there and all the judges and you for being on the show and thanks special thanks jill gilbert who's done an amazing job i can only imagine what it takes to do something like that to put it together great cheers